Hello everybody, Dr. Rick Wallace here dropping in on you. I hope that everybody is having an unbelievable start to your week. Uh, I hope that you are focused. I hope that you are centered. But most importantly, I hope that you are committed. Uh, I cannot stress the importance of being committed uh, to the cause. Um, there are a couple of things I'm going to share with you today, and I hope that um, brings some uh, lucidity uh, to your vision, uh, to your approach, to your ability to interpret where you are right now in your journey. And let me tell you something. It's going to be important for you in this journey. If you're striving to be greater, striving to be better, striving to achieve more, uh, then you need to understand this one truth that I'm about to share with you here. And then I'm going to tell you uh, uh, about the approach. The truth that I want to share with you is real simple. The truth is this. You have to be more engaged and embracing the journey than you are focused on the destination. And that may sound crazy to some people. Uh, because you always keep your eye on the prize. Yeah, you need to definitely have your eye on the prize. But what you've got to understand about any prize, whether it's a 90-day goal, whether it's uh, a six-month goal, a year goal, maybe it's a 10-year goal, maybe it's a life goal, uh, the one thing you have to understand is whenever you hit that goal, you've hit it. And you have that moment that you hit it, and you take whatever time necessary to celebrate and appreciate that moment, then it's on to the next thing. So that destination that you're headed to is real, real momentary in its reality. Now, it may have a lasting and lifetime impact on you and others, but the achieving of it is in the moment. And if it's a 90-day goal, if it's a six-month goal, a year ago, you can't live in it long because you need to move on to the next thing. Life is about a consistent and constant process towards growth. But if you, all you have is that 90-day goal, when you reach it, then there's this emptiness and there's this 90 days you took to get to this moment. And it has to make sense. And for me, it does make sense. But what I've learned is the joy is in the journey. The joy is in overcoming and achieving. How many things that I had that I have to overcome to get to this goal? How many times did I have to adjust to get to this goal? How many people wrote me off in the pursuit of this goal? How many times?